I'll hit you with the good news and then I'll hit you with the bad news. So the good news is the lava lamp works and it is awesome and it's so calming to watch. We did have to leave it plugged in for like 14 hours straight. The wax in the middle, like the orange stuff, was so solid that it had to basically like melt down forever but now it's the second day we've had it and it's awesome and also dog man loved the leather hat time for dog man to try on the hat is it really big no does it fit pretty good <laughs> yeah actually maybe it's a little oh no i was worried because uh, wait are you just like a crash test dummy now <laughs> <laughs> do you, do you like it or is it too crocodile done? Right oh. <laughs> I've got a hat. I've got a hat. I've got a hat. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Now on to the bad news. When I filmed the beginning of the video, the outfit of the day portion, it was sprinkling just a little bit, which did not click in my brain that if raindrops fell onto the camera, it would potentially fall into the internal microphone. I ended up doing a whole vlog portion, the whole first half, maybe even more than that, like the first seven minutes of what I was talking about. The audio is so bad, insert a clip. And I'm like, oh my God, I honestly feel like a sack of potatoes right now. That I feel like ultimately I just have to cut that whole segment. And I'm so annoyed by that because I feel like I finally said some things and got some stuff off of my chest that I have been trying to express for months now. I started out like wanting to film somewhere else and do something different and then the rain totally threw me off and then I ended up basically just going to Walmart to get some necessities that I needed. Cue the remainder of the video. This video is such a mess. Pray for day three of Vlogoween. We should at least hang one thing in vlog car today he came in the mail vintage plastic skeleton i think that he is supposed to be from the 70s we have finally made it to walmart hours later like i've been trying to film this video now for like five hours today also i feel like i've got some real doc brown hair frizz realness going on right now Wait. God. I also feel absolutely absurd to be going to Walmart dressed this way. Like I definitely feel like this is a warm sunshine daytime outfit, but at night I'm just gonna be very cold in here. I need a bucket, I need fabric softener, I need paint, I need like grape something, grape soda, grape gum. I'm craving grapes in my mouth. Should I engage earthworm? Why am I walking this way? It's like suddenly I wanted to look at pet tags. But for some reason for me to wear, I don't know. Oh my God. Wait, is everyone here? There's like a long hallway of carts <laughs> and they're all gone. Oh no, my shoe's untied. There's just a box of heads. That's what everyone needs. Box of heads. Oh, it's a pony head. Look, the choices of heads are endless. Look, we can take a quick perusal at the Walmart Halloween selection. Ew, I see aliens. What is this? Oh, it's a mask. That's cute. Oh my gosh. It's like a snack tin, but it's called a window tin. And then on the inside, there's little pumpkins in there. I should get this for Dogman. Bright orange skull mug. Wow, I feel like they have so many cute like party trays and buckets look at these treat bags i feel like i have seven lifetime supply of treat bags but i also want these oh cool look at all the giveaway stuff it's like a pack of 50 sticky hands what is this this just says halloween party favors oh it's like glasses or no those are yo-yos i don't know look teeth uh, there's 88 pieces in here and it's only seven dollars that seems like a pretty good deal i want to get some of these aren't these called hair falls those things with like the little springy things on the end but i want some to be like really full you guys have to comment down below how y'all feel about pastel halloween i feel like that is a big 
Halloween decorating trend this year. I don't know how I feel about it. Like I kind of like it and then the other part of me is like, no, Halloween must be black and orange. Oh, what is this? Way up here. Like a three-dimensional skull? Is this like a bag? I feel like this is the kind of item that I could maybe get half off like after Halloween, but I'm also scared they're gonna run out and then I'll forever regret if I don't get one. Ew, look at these. Look, there's a bunch of different styles. Like here's teeth that look like mine. Ew, and then we got these like snaggly ones. I bet that would make a really scary jack-o'-lantern. And then those are the ones I picked up, which is Vampire. Look at this. This is an inflatable of Frankenstein on the toilet. Reading Graveyard Times. I don't know what it is about Walmart today, but it is filled with the screams of children. Wow, you guys. Oh my gosh, it's like a hundred bucks. So it's actually not that cheap. But do you guys remember the Does This Thing Really Work I did last year? about atmosphere effects. I guess now Walmart has come out with one. So it has nine different movies and then they have this one that also includes nine. It's 58 and it looks much smaller. Whoa, that one looks really cool. Look at that one that looks like a portrait. It looks like we have some similar ones and some different ones. I feel like the smaller one actually has cooler display. So I'm gonna get one of those. We can test it out in a video. I don't know how you guys feel about these, but I love them. That one's called Fire and Ice. Oh, that one is so cute. The camera wants to focus on everything but it. Those are multicolored ghosts, but you guys can probably see there's like a ton of them that's way even more than the sample ones that they have. Whoa, what are these? Projection shadow waves. Oh, that's really cool. I wanna do a Halloween Christmas tree again this year. It has been years since I have done one. Look at these sprinkles. They're called Monster Bash. How freaking cool is that? I love those colors. And then here we have a huge selection of all of the costume stuff. We've got a lot of wigs. Actually like a really pretty color for wigs. Like I like that. It kind of makes me think of like Starbursts. Pumpkin Pal color changing steak. That's pretty cool. I guess you like can put them inside of your jack-o'-lanterns and it makes them like flash. That's really cool. Look at that. Can I make a flower arrangement? That would be perfect for a Halloween Christmas tree. It's only a dollar and 98 cents. All of these. Oh my gosh, that would be so awesome to make a Halloween tree ornament out of as well. Oh my God, it's just a leg. Oh no, this one's broken. That's kind of funny for a tree too. What colors should I get? I kind of like orange and black. Wait, is this called witch foot? That's hilarious. Cutest ghost ever. This is so cute too. We have a Grim Reaper going to the bathroom. I guess you still have to go to the bathroom in the afterlife. Ew! Oh my God. It just keeps farting. It won't stop. These are so cute too. Uh, oh my gosh, how much is that? Three dollars, actually two dollars and fifty cents. Oh my god, is that supposed to be Thanos? We have one big long aisle of costumes. That's actually a really good skull mask. I saw an amazing DIY that uses these. Let me know if you guys think we should try and make it. It takes 60 foam jack-o'-lanterns like this. It seems like a massive undertaking and I don't feel like I've ever done a DIY that's that advanced. I didn't want to get a bag of webs to decorate the inside of the Jeep with. Practical. Practical. I'm that close and I still missed. We've got a lot more costumes down here and trick or treat buckets. You guys, hear me out. I think I might give away to every trick or treater a trick or treat bucket this year. Not a bag, a bucket. Too extreme. Oh my gosh. Look at this. 
It's a rhinestone bunny headband. I kind of want to wear this triceratops. Doesn't he look like he wants to be my buddy? My buddy, my buddy. Do you guys remember my buddy? I think that that was the inspiration for the Chucky doll. Oh my gosh. I just found something that I have been looking for and I kind of thought that they didn't make them anymore. I used to stick these in my car all the time. The inside of my car used to look like a rave. They are like permanent battery operated glow sticks. I'm gonna get a couple of orange ones. I realize I used to secure them to my car visor by using a like, you know those like CD visor things that have like the elastic. I'm gonna go over to the car department and even see if they still make them. Cause I'm like, oh my God, like cars don't even have CD players in them anymore. That was the weakest basket toss ever. I should just be disqualified from basket toss. <laughs> oh my God, this is amazing. It's an alligator toilet seat cover. It's like a window cling. Why is there so many bathroom decorations? I guess I'm not festive enough, you guys. The queen of Halloween. I'm not decorating the bathrooms. What am I doing? Oh wow, they have these like here. You guys, I keep thinking about doing a wish Halloween haul and I honestly think that they're a lot cheaper on Wish which is kind of crazy because I feel like almost nothing in the world is cheaper than Walmart. Look it's just a foot. Oh my god it is just a foot. It's just a foot being sold like I thought somebody pulled apart a skeleton but it's just a foot. Look I kind of want to make a headband out of this. Wait is this just a jaw being sold? Like just a skeleton's jaw. So many cute and tempting inflatables. Like I love this little ghost. Oh my gosh he's eight foot tall too. I'm gonna do it bigger and better than ever this year. I feel like every year I'm trying to top like what I gave away the year prior and I'm like but where where is the end of this? Like where have I just maxed out all possibilities? I, I want to give out treat buckets this year. I want to do popcorn and of course I'm gonna do cotton candy and I keep thinking about doing snow cones but is that too much? Oh my god okay i've wandered over here and look at what i have discovered oh my god wait look at this one it's like a taco with a mouth it is freaking christmas over here santa's a jolly guy but it's not your time yet why am i like that though because i would be so excited like if they had halloween stuff out in february <laughs> my face moves when you give me the pacifier i'm trying to Ew. And I'm gonna get it because I hate it. I want to do that mirror challenge. Have you seen it where people like split their face with a mirror? Ew. Oh my god, I just licked the mirror. It's not funny anymore and my camera battery is flashing. I'm actually on my real mission now, which is a bucket and a car visor. Okay, you guys, place your bets now. Do they still sell CD visor holders for cars or not? Oh look, car stuff. Oh, ow. Oh my God, I just ran over myself with a cart. What does pure steel smell like? I love it. I don't know why. That's just my aesthetic, I guess. Why am I loving that? Oh my God, okay, now it's just called a visor organizer. Oh my God, they're all falling on me. Visor organizer now. I don't think they have a straight up CD one. Oh, look, there it is, CD. Oh, that makes sense because now there's DVD players in cars. I almost forgot the most important part of this mission. Wait, you guys, there's one called Jack-O-Lantern. This one's a little bit brighter and it's called Pumpkin Patch. There's nobody here though that can mix paint right now. I hate this song that just came on. Does that ever happen to you guys? When you're just shopping and then all of a sudden you just hear a song playing in public that you hate? That's just the way it is. Some things will never change. Oh, except for I do like the Tupac version. But this is like not that version. This is like the crap version. <laughs> okay. I'm honestly just shook ever since I accidentally licked that mirror. This where the buckets belong? There was like a run on buckets. Oh my god, this is the buckets. What the heck? Uh, uh. Wait, did they just move the buckets? 
buckets, you get your own in cap today. You're the star of the show. Oh my god, I'm about to put my head in a bucket. Um, something will never change. What scares Darth Vader? Do you guys want to see like the cutest thing ever? Look at this dead bull mascot head. But I feel like this one is like so weird. Like doesn't the mouth or like the lack of chin just make him look like the cutest Deadpool ever? I feel like Dogman would love that. So I feel like that's going in the cart. Look at all of these awesome light up earrings. These are so cute. Ooh, I love these. Oh my gosh. They even have Halloween scrunchies. I feel like Walmart has given Target a run for their money this year. Oh my gosh, like look at this. Light up skull headband. So cute. And then they have some with spider webs. It looks like we've got skulls back here. What is this, witches? No, black cats and moons and bats. That is really, really cute. Ooh, I love these. It's like a metallic foil witch. These are so soft. Dude, these are $5.97. That is such a good deal. It's like a Harley Quinn costume, costume? <laughs> costume t-shirt and it has the little hood attached. They actually have a couple different designs. Wonder Woman, oh my God, is this Batman? <gasps> I am loving this. It's got the cape attached. Oh my God, and bat ears. Jack Skellington, of course, with a little Jack hoodie top. Oh my gosh, this is so cute and so soft. It's so soft on the inside too. Oh my God, I am in love, $10. This is like my magic day. Look at these pajamas. It's the sequin thing. Look, one side flipped up says treat, and then the other side says trick. It's all real monsters, super plush pajama pants. Only $10. This is why my cart looks like this. Somehow, just filming today's vlog, I've gone through three whole batteries. I don't even understand how that's possible. So I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. I feel like today was kind of weird. It was a mashup of like a tea vlog, an outfit of the day, a follow me around. We did a little bit of everything. So I bought some of those cool light displays and hopefully I will remember to plug them in and test them in tomorrow's video. But I'm gonna go and actually like focus on my shopping. I feel like when I'm filming, I get so distracted. So I'm gonna make a quick sweep all around the store again and make sure I get everything I need and I'm gonna try and see if I can find somebody who can mix the paint for me tonight. I think we're actually gonna start painting vlogoing room tomorrow. I am so excited. Are you guys excited? Okay, thank y'all so, so much for watching today's video. If you're not already and you'd like to be, hit that button down below, subscribe, become a member of the Swamp Family, and give an alligator its wings. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye!